I am glad to welcome you to the Auto Problems channel. Environmental concerns and ever-tightening environmental regulations are forcing automakers to reduce the weight of their cars as much as possible and equip them with small capacity and less resource-intensive engines, as many years ago. As a result, among motorists, the phrase often slips that real cars are no longer made, and the only way out is to find a decent option among used models that have earned the title of reliable. At present, it is far from uncommon to find cars of venerable age on the street, which still have not lost their relevance and are in demand on the market due to their practicality and survivability. Today we'd like to take a peek at our catalog to see what the market has to offer and take a look at a few cars 10 years and older. Mercedes E-Class W211 The Mercedes-Benz E-Class of the W211 series has not earned the most flattering reviews from its owners, but this applies to cars from the first years of production, from 2002 to 2004. After modernization in 2006, the business class sedan got rid of most of the defects and became noticeably more reliable. It is worth noting that the W211 body, in comparison with its predecessor, is much better protected from corrosion. When choosing a W211 Eschke, it is recommended to pay special attention to the performance of the air suspension. Unlike its predecessor, instead of steel levers, aluminum ones were used in the suspension, which wear out quite quickly on our roads, and replacing them is not a cheap pleasure. There are also frequent failures in the operation of electronic systems, especially on pre-styling models at the SBC control unit, electronic brake control system. The 211th has a very wide choice of power units. According to experts, Mercedes gasoline engines are very picky about fuel, and the most reliable of them is called the M112, 2.6 liters, 205 horsepower, which, with timely care, practically does not cause problems. Diesel engines are also sensitive to the quality of diesel fuel and are not without drawbacks that are typical for most units running on heavy fuel. Among them, a 5-cylinder 2.7-liter engine, 270 CDI, and a 3.2-liter V6 are recommended. By tradition, we contacted one of the sellers, choosing an ad that states the perfect technical condition and original mileage of the car. The owner assured that the car, despite its age, looks very dignified, of course, there are minor scratches on the bumpers, and the paint on the rear arch is also swollen. The previous owner tinted it to the tank cap about five years ago. When I took the car, nothing was visible, and it appeared only after 2.5 years, but this is not striking. In general, they looked after the car, because it was taken for itself, and if problems appeared, they were immediately eliminated. As for the technical component, here, according to the seller, there are no surprises for the future owner, this car has already been checked a hundred times, both the box and the engine. Of the nuances, a thermostat error pops up, but by itself it appears and then disappears. If it burned constantly, then I would have already changed the engine, and so this, apparently, is just a minor failure. The man also noted that the front shock absorber struts, ball joint, and tie rod had recently been replaced. At the official service, they did a wheel alignment on all four wheels and diagnostics, they did not reveal any problems. Naturally, it is difficult to give guarantees, this is used equipment, but I can assure you that the car is really very good," he added. BMW 5 Series E39 The eternal rival of Mercedes, the BMW 5 Series in the back of the E39, although not considered very prestigious, stands out as the best 5 in recent history in terms of quality, drive and reliability. The Bavarian model was a resounding success in the market. Despite the high prices, Around 200,000 vehicles were sold worldwide each year. Great demand in the past has contributed to a fairly impressive number of offers on the secondary market now. It's no secret that it is very difficult to find a live, well-groomed option in our open spaces, since there is a high risk of running into a copy after a serious accident, or hackney to death. Experts advise to carefully inspect the body and, taking it for granted that, most likely, the sedan got into an accident in the past, pay attention to the quality of its restoration. The Bavarian sedan often has problems with the electric and electronics. In particular, the temperature sensors of the air conditioner, airbags and ABS are subject to them. In addition, power windows are prone to breakdowns and the display of a set of indicators on the instrument panel often burns out. For the first time for the 5 on the E39, a multi-link suspension was installed, most of which is made of aluminum. Traditional weak points are the lower transverse levers and silent blocks of the front jet thrust floating silent blocks of the lower transverse levers of the rear suspension. Original spare parts are still expensive today, therefore, before selling, it is practice to replace worn parts with new ones, 
but of dubious quality with a short service life. The BMW E39 was equipped with 6 and 8 cylinder gasoline engines, and 4 and 6 cylinder diesel power units. Gasoline engines installed under the hood of the 5 are considered very reliable. As a rule, only the cooling system requires attention. Of the diesel engines, experts recommend a well-known diesel M57 with a volume of 3 liters for purchase. Automatic transmissions are quite reliable and maintainable, but the cars on the mechanics are more liquid, and the engine with them is usually safer. The seller of the 2003 copy we have chosen said by phone that he got the car initially in good condition and did not cause serious problems for two years of ownership. I followed the car and tried not to bring it to critical nuances. The previous owners were adequate people, so this is really a worthy copy, and I myself have a grandfather's driving style. Here, the man noted, finding an E39 in good condition is almost impossible. For a good option, people want good money, because they understand what they are asking for. Look at the cheap haze, and then come and compare it with the inspected car, and everything will become clear. During the conversation, the owner emphasized that his BMW really has a real mileage of just over 200,000 kilometers. This is considering the fact that the motors are millionaires, plus a reliable automatic and an accident-free past. This sedan will give odds to any modern budget car. Now, after 100,000 kilometer, they often need to change the entire engine, but here this is not even close. They don't make cars like this anymore. When asked about the well-known high cost of servicing the German, the owner noted, well, it depends on what to compare with, and it all depends on the severity of the problem, you can, for example, kill the entire suspension, or maybe you only need to change the ball. In addition, you can take in non-original spare parts. If one original suspension arm can pull a to USD 100, then the Chinese counterpart will cost $40. Although with a normal driving style, China walks for a long time. Finally, the seller warned that this is a very nimble car that does not like jokes and does not forgive mistakes. Audi A6, C5 If you consider the new Audis to be short-lived tents, then you can take a closer look at the model of the times when progress in the automotive industry did not mean complicating the design in the name of economy and increasing the profitability of the service stations of official dealers, but really improved car performance. The A6, C5 model has been included in various automobile ratings more than once and has taken root perfectly in the CIS. An important factor in this was a fully galvanized body, not subject to corrosion, and one of the most spacious interiors in the class. Like the above models, the weak point of the cars is the suspension, also aluminum with the front multi-link, requiring frequent repairs, especially with constant use on bad roads. The variety of the Audi A6 engine range is impressive, 10 petrol and 3 diesel engines, However, only the 1.8-liter unit is really inexpensive to maintain on an old car. The remaining gasoline engines are noticeably more expensive to operate. Auto experts advise fans of diesel engines to pay attention to the 1.9 TDI engine, 110 horsepower. Modification with unit injectors can be 115 or 130 horsepower, but you will have to pay extra for the increased power in case of repair. With proper maintenance, 1.9-liter diesel engines go 400,000 kilometers without repair. Automatic transmissions are quite reliable and simple, but, given the age of the C5S, it is clear that their resource has long been depleted and you need to look for one that has undergone a complete overhaul in the reliable hands of a specialized service station master. There will be more problems with the variator due to the small resource of the bell. Audi's all-wheel drive is considered one of the most reliable components, so even 20-year-old cars have no problems with it. From the ads collected in our catalog, we chose a 16-year-old sedan, in the description of which it was indicated only that the car was ideal. According to the owner, the car was imported from France and drove through Belarus no more than 20,000 kilometers. I don't see any problems with the car. There is only a small scratch on the body, and you need to buy new summer tires. It will be possible to bargain for this. All consumables have recently changed. After 40,000 kilometers, it will be necessary to change the timing, said the man. The seller did not go into details, only assuring that the car was very good. I didn't even take a gram of oil on a long trip, but there was no need for it anymore. Volkswagen Passat B5 Unlike previous German models, the Volkswagen Passat is a lower class car. But this car, thanks to several extremely successful generations, has also earned the status of a legend, at least among Belarusians. Unlike its predecessors, B3 and before, which were built on their own platform, the Passat B5 was strongly unified with the Audi A4 with the same B5 index. The fifth Passat, unlike later models, has a zinc coating on almost all elements. Of course, 
Given the age of the cars, one cannot count on the ideal condition of their bodies, nevertheless, the number of copies in decent condition is quite large and the chances of finding an option in good condition are very high, especially in the absence of a hard price limit. The biggest problem of the car in terms of electronics is the age and exhausted resource of control units. The multi-link suspension of the Passat B5 is quite complicated, and there are many options for execution. For different motors and types of drive there are their own nodes, which greatly complicates the selection of components and often requires work to be done immediately on the right and left, otherwise the wheel alignment angles are violated. But transmissions for cars are praised for a good resource, reliability and accessibility for repairs. There were cases when there were units with a mileage of up to 500,000 km without major repairs. The fifth generation Passat was equipped with an extensive range of engines, 10 petrol and 7 diesel. 8-valve engines were recognized as the most successful, and the 1.6-valve unit was remembered by many as an almost perfect engine, simple, reliable and cheap, and it was put on the VW Golf and Skoda Octavia for a long time. Now most of the problems of any B5 engines are related to their age, but the safety margin built into those series of units will allow them to do their job for a long time after overhaul. As in the previous case, we could not find out any special details about the 14-year-old sedan we chose. I have had the car since December last year. Never failed. On the body in several places there are beetles, and so it is all in the native paint. There are absolutely no complaints about the cabin. Everything that needs to be replaced, timing, pump, oil and filters, nothing needs to be done in the foreseeable future. At the hood, a small bargain is possible, within 200 US dollars. Toyota Camry Well, I would like to finish our today's review with a Japanese model. The choice fell on the 6th generation Camry with the XV40 body, which, thanks to its attractive appearance, comfort, simplicity and reliability, secured a consistently high demand. According to experts, Camry is great for those who want to visit the technical inspection station only for scheduled maintenance. A model with 167 and 277 horsepower engines and a working volume of 2.4 and 3.5 liters, respectively, was presented on our market. Both units are considered quite reliable, and their service life, with proper care, varies in the range of 350 to 500,000 km. A more economical and practical option, of course, is a modification with a weaker motor. Camry in the back of the XV40 was supplied with three gearbox options, a 5-speed manual transmission worked with a 2.4-liter unit, which, according to the owners, after reaching 60,000 km, could have difficulty shifting gears. 5-speed automatic transmissions usually work properly, without serious problems, which cannot be said about 6-speed automatic transmissions, the average operational life of which is 150,000 km. There are no serious complaints about the suspension, with the exception of the peculiarities when replacing the lower arm of the front suspension. The real weak point of the Camry XV40 is called the handbrake. He did not fail to pay attention to the 2.4-liter engine recommended by experts. This unit is considered one of the most reliable and runs 400,000 km without problems. My sister has one on her RAV4, and she takes care of the car terribly. At the same time, I have already skated 300,000 km and there has never been a single breakdown. There are no questions about the box either, but I constantly change the oil, filters, the procedure, of course, is quite expensive, but I don't save on spare parts and put only the original. Plus, I recently installed a new battery, and the old one, judging by the release date, was native. That's all for me, thank you all for your attention, I will be very grateful to you if you subscribe to the channel, see you soon.